what is up guys welcome to another vlog so today for the very first time ever i am visiting the iconic and historic kalk bay so it is quite a drive from cape town it's about a from Cape Town CBD it's about a half an hour's drive from Wellington where I am staying it's about a one hour and ten minute drive the best view behind you and also with the iconic rails so I am here to explore and to give you guys the best things to do in Kalk Bay also a huge shout out to Night Owl once again for these lovely earrings also give them a like and a follow as well smash the like button leave a positive comment down below and let's do this all right so right behind me is a market i'm not sure if they have the market if it's on every uh, saturday but nevertheless, we are here, so we are going to explore everything. And I'm going to show you as much as possible there is to explore in Kalk Bay. As you could see, this market has a lot to offer. There's clothing, there's even like a fruit, a smoothie a stall, there's a coffee stall as well and there's books and a little bit of everything I am in a little alley which is called memory lane as you can see it is so so cool how they decorate it there's like old vinyls and um yeah so let's see what we can find here but it's cool man cold bay is very very cool papa gayo is actually it's a very very cool shop but the vibe that i'm getting from cold bay is that it is like a hippie type of vibe because even with the, the clothing shops it's clothes that you don't normally get in your like normal stores um, or in a mall or something but it is such a such a cool vibe man I love the vibe another awesome shop among the many there is is Global Beats they sell beads and they sell different types of jewelry The ice cafe is definitely the place to go when you want an authentic Italian ice cream. Cheers! That ice cream was delicious, by the way. And, um, yeah, and something that I realize about Cold Bay is that there's a lot of clothing shops and it is like a hippie type of vibe, like I said. And even there's people to entertain you along the way, as you saw as well, which is pretty cool. So, um, so yeah, it is, it is really an awesome type of vibe. <laughs> This is also one of the well-known restaurants, the Brass Bell in Cold Bay. Um, as you can see, a beautiful view. Uh, just wait for it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> a beautiful view. There's a tidal pool as well for the kids to swim in. I know last year there were heavy storms in Western Cape and the water actually came through this part. I think it was this part. Um, through the windows and it destroyed everything but I see that 
everything is now back to normal thankfully once again so uh, yeah but it's also it, it's such a beautiful view this is also another famous stop is the trading post I think they have like books and everything but what I'm about to show you in a bit is is gonna really gonna blow your mind guys how cool is this you actually get to sit on a train <laughs> this is very very cool um, yeah it's so antique and beautiful inside the restaurant is called Sirocco and then there's like seating outside but I prefer to sit on a train so how cool is this So behind me is active rails so for a day trip with a family and friends you can take a train trip from Cape Town and it ends in Simonstown so you drive all along you have this scenic view as you can see it's so so beautiful the next stop and probably the last stop as well of this vlog is a go-to or a must visit so this was actually my mission in Kalk Bay I've heard of this place many times and it is called Cape to Cuba so it's a it's a Cuban place so I'm super excited to at last be visiting them guys so this was cold Bay so now you have a bit of an idea of the things to do in cold Bay it's really such an awesome town I can really and highly recommend it so it is really an awesome town so be sure to visit cold Bay and let me know what you think of the town smash the hell out of that like button leave a positive comment down below share this vlog with your family and friends and I'll see you on the next one. Why can't we